Good morning, Greater Piney Grove. Welcome to another edition of GNN, the Grove News Network. I'm your host, Candace Pendergrass. Here are your Grove announcements for Sunday, February 10th. The month of February is Black History Month. Each Sunday, the Grove will highlight an unsung Black History moment. This morning, we celebrate African-American trailblazer inventors. We honor the trailblazer inventor, Dr. Gladys West. Dr. Gladys West is a mathematician known for her contribution to the mathematical modeling of the shape of the Earth. She was on the team of mathematicians who worked on the development of the satellite geodesy models that were eventually incorporated into the Global Positioning System, better known to us as the GPS. In 1956, West began to work at Naval Surface Warfare Center Dog Green Division, where she was the second black woman ever to be employed. West began to analyze data from satellites, putting together autometer models of the Earth's shape, which were eventually used in the development of global positioning system. Her contributions to GPS were uncovered when a member of West's sorority, Alpha Kappa Alpha, read a short biography West had submitted for an alumni function. West was selected by the BBC as part of their 2018 100 Women. She was inducted into the United States Air Force Hall of Fame in 2018, one of the Air Force Space Command's highest honors. She was described as one of the pioneering hidden figures who did essential mathematical computing for the United States Armed Forces before electronic systems. So the next time you use any navigation device or software like Google Maps, be proud it was a black woman who invented it and thank Dr. Gladys West, the inventor of GPS systems. Dr. Gladys West, the Grove salutes you this morning as an inventor trailblazer. To our first time guests, on behalf of our senior pastor, first lady, the Grove leadership and family, we would like to welcome you to the Grove. As our first time guests, for those who are tech savvy, we ask you pull out your cell phones and text Easy Grove to 797979. That's 79 three times. A link will be sent to you. Click the link and simply follow the instructions. Or you can fill out our first time guest card and during offering time, place the card in one of our offering baskets so you can personally hear from our senior pastor this week. As our special guest, before the benediction, you will be the first to meet our senior pastor and first lady immediately following this service in the narthex. And we will have a special gift for you in the Kingdom Connection Bookstore. Welcome to the Grove. Today at both services, we celebrate our annual missions and evangelism celebration under the leadership of our Mission Pillar Pastor, Shianti Harris, and our Evangelism Pillar Pastor, Herman Haynes. This past year, with your support, we've assisted hundreds of families with food, prayer, holiday support, and counseling. We are grateful for the helping hands that have assisted us thus far. However, we need more hands on deck. Be on the lookout for an email soliciting volunteers for upcoming missions and evangelism opportunities. With your continued support, we are the church with helping hands. If you would like to know more about the evangelism, mission pillars, and how to get involved and equipped in mission, outreach, and evangelism, contact and or see either our mission, Pastor Shianti Harris via email, or our evangelism, Pastor Herman Haynes. Also, join us this afternoon at 3 p.m. for our annual general mission service with our guest preacher and church, Rev. Dr. R. L. White, Senior Pastor of Mount Ephraim Baptist Church. This morning, our senior pastor will continue to preach on the sermon series, The Tabernacle, God's Dwelling Place. We pray you will continue to be blessed by these sermon series preached by our senior pastor. Friendly reminder, Tuesday Bible Study is at noon on every Tuesday and Tuesday evening Bible study resumes at 7 p.m. All young adults of the Grove, we have our first Young Adults The Gathering of 2019 this coming Tuesday at 7 p.m. in Annex C located in the basement of the Worship Center. We will have Reverend Jennifer Carner, Executive Pastor of House of Hope of Atlanta, as our special guest facilitator for the month of February. You don't want to miss it. For more information about the gathering, please see and or contact Pastor Richard via email. 
The Grove is honored to be the satellite host for the 2019 Work as Worship Live Stream Retreat on Friday, February 22nd at 8.30 a.m. You can register by clicking on the Grove's Work as Worship Live Stream Retreat web banner on our website. Registration is only $30 and includes lunch. For more information, please see and or contact Christian Educator Director Dr. Albert King Marshall via email. We close out the month of February with fun and laughter on Saturday, February 23rd at 6 p.m. and Sunday, February 24th at 5 p.m. with a family fun production play in the Frank Jones Memorial Chapel. The Greater Piney Grove presents the production play Museum of Music Legend, directed by Dr. Joyce Miller. Tickets are now on sale for $10 and can be purchased immediately following this service in the Kingdom Connection Bookstore. Come get your tickets while they last. For more information, please see and or contact Dr. Joyce Miller via email. Love is in the air at the Greater Piney Grove. In celebration of Valentine's Day, the Kingdom Connection Bookstore is offering a Valentine's special for your heartbeat. Place your order for flowers in the bookstore. 10% of each order will go to the Heritage Fund. Deadline to place your order is today. Designs by Accent Florist and Decor Incorporated. Are you committed? Have you committed yet? The Heritage Commitment Ministry encourages you to make a faithful pledge commitment towards our Heritage Commitment. You can make a commitment either by filling out the commitment card, just ask one of our ushers for one, and simply place it either in the offering basket or drop it in the tithe box located in the narthex. Or you can fill out the commitment electronically by simply going to our website and clicking on the Heritage Commitment web banner. Reminder, we have transitioned from the Christ Fund to the Heritage Commitment. All commitments require a signed commitment either on the commitment card or on our website through ACS. For more information, please see Deacon Irvin or Deaconess Ernie Fuller. That concludes this Sunday's GNN announcements. Again, I'm Candace Pendergrass. I pray you have a blessed week. Be blessed, Grove family. For more information and to view what's happening at the Grove, log on to our website, greaterpineygrove.com.